Alright, sup folks. Today um, we are going to be talking about good baits to use in early spring and winter. Because although bass don't eat as much and they don't bite things that move as fast, they still eat. Anything has to eat. I'm going to show y'all a few baits that you can use when it's cold or when the fish just don't seem to be biting much. I'll show you some tried and true baits that will get them. Also, I gotta tell y'all, I don't own the rights to any of the brands in this video. I'm just putting that out there. Your boy ain't trying to get copyrighted. But, uh, let's get to it. Alright, straight up, we're starting off with the classic Senko. 5 inch Senko Gear Yamamoto. You can fish it at any speed. And, uh, it just seems to get them. And, uh, like I say, Gear Yamamoto. Um, trick worms are a all year bait. Uh, make sure you get some that are good and salty. Gear Yamamoto's tend to be more expensive, but they also work better. I caught my PB on a straight up bass fishing hook and a trick worm. So, um, next up is our OG of this list. It ain't famous and it ain't talked about much, but um, it works for sure. Alright, classic Zoom Super Salt Plus Fluke. Your best bet for any type of winter or early spring fishing. It's your best bet. You, know, you can never go wrong with a fluke. You can literally bottom fish it and uh, in the winter and like pop it, leave it there for 10 seconds, pop it. Be sure you're reeling your slack. But, um, yeah. It's a great winter bait because it looks like a bait fish. And a good hearty meal is what a bass would love to have to allow them to skip other meals. So, um, moving on to the next bait. Next up is Carl's Amazing Baits. Uh, let's see. Blue Crawl. Shout out to them. Um, yeah, anything, so in the winter, bass are going to tend to feed on, uh, bait fish and crawfish, dang, there's many out here, they're going to tend to feed on, uh, bait fish and crawfish, and that's why you see the red on their mouth when it's cold, because they'll be feeding on, on a lot of crawfish, because they're slow moving prey, but yeah, anything you can just jig, jig on the bottom, uh, gonna be a banger but uh I'll see y'all on the next best but certainly not least is the zoom red shad what are they called you tell sorry fish these all the time I honestly like the Texas rig it I'm sure a lot of y'all probably won't like that but yeah I just take this rig it um it can be fished I honestly just like to, because of how well the tail moves, see, that's really sensitive. What I like to do is just straight, slow reel it. You can give it a little jig every once in a while, but I pretty much just like to slowly reel it back to me. But anyways, um, if y'all like this, please remember to like, subscribe, all that stuff. Love y'all. See y'all in the next one.